So he tried to hug the priest, and that's how I knew he was gay. Wow, dude, that's crazy. I know, it completely blew my mind. So, uh, what's been up with you lately? Feels like I haven't talked to you in, like, a couple months. Nothing much, I've just been crazy busy. You still working on that program thing? Yeah, but when I was wor working on it last night, I ran into a problem where I would try to print out this one thing, but it would just print out a banana, so I got really confused and quit. my brother, Eric. Wait, you've never met him before? No. Why is he wearing that mask? Don't you know? My brother's the Phantom of the Opera. Wait, what? Hey, yeah, dude, my brother's the Phantom. Wait, how is that even possible? Shh, quiet down. He's very sensitive about his name. No, how is he actually the Phantom of the Opera? That's what he's always been. He was horribly deformed as a baby, so we put that mask on him. Some Persian dude left him on our doorstep. But the Phantom of the Opera is a fictional character. Yeah, well, tell that to him. Hey, are you actually the fan of the opera? <laughs> what the hell was that? It means he likes you. Since when did the fan of the opera speak in growling noises? Did you even read that book? Nah, I just read the Wikipedia article. Oh, well, he speaks in a series of grunts and moans the whole time. I'm pretty sure he didn't do that at all. Is your brother the Phantom of the Opera? Uh, no. Exactly. Whatever, dude. But your brother seriously scares me. Dude, calm down. He's harmless. Oh. See? Hey, yeah. He actually gives an amazing massage. It's fantastic. Eric, stop! That's a bad phantom! Stop! Stop! What the hell was that? Wait, I know how to go that. Hey, Eric! sure if I just stumbled into an acid trip, but if this is real, wow, wow. I know, he's a beautiful dancer. Is there anything else that I should know about your family, dude? Well, my grandfather was the Great Gatsby, and my father is Indiana Jones. 